Inside the Skate and Place facility, what unfolds is similar to many arrests. Except this one is a 12-year-old girl. Watch again. You can see one Hamilton County deputy struggling to take the girl to the ground as it appears the other officer goes for his stun gun. There's a second angle, apparently a few seconds later. Deputies say the girl was shocked, but that's not captured on the videos. Neither is the outrage of her parents. The girl's father talked to us by phone. I mean, at this point, I'm beyond angry. I'm, I'm hurt. And then this is in front of a whole ton of kids. So you have babies that witnessed this, her peers. Now, there, it's an ongoing investigation. Hamilton County Sheriff Jim Neal would not talk about specifics, but his office sent out a release saying the girl was using extremely disrespectful language, had been told multiple times to leave. And when deputies attempted to escort her out, she hit one of them in the face twice and began kicking both deputies. And that's when she was taken down. Investigators make the distinction that she was contact stunned, not shot by the barbs of the stun gun. The girl's version of what happened and the deputies are not entirely different. But whether it was an appropriate use of force is the question by her parents. Now, there is security video from inside that skating rink. It shows the entire event. Deputies have not released that yet. The girl's due in court here at 2020 tomorrow. Reporting live, Brian Hamrick, WLWT News 5.